Greetings, story time friends. Today, we're going to sing a song about a spider, but not a big, fat, hairy spider, an itsy bitsy spider. And then we're going to learn how to draw the spider. So andiamo, let's go. Today's song really bugs me because it's about a bug. A spider, an itsy bitsy spider, not a big fat hairy spider, not allowed. An itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider, what did he do? Yes, he went up the spout again. He is a fighter spider. He doesn't give up. He keeps up going. <laughs> I like this spider. Get your spiders ready. Itsy bitsy, please. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. You're also going to sing along with me very, very loud so I can hear you. You got it? Let's go. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy Bitsy spider. He went up the spout again. He went up the spout again. It's time for us to draw the itsy bitsy spider. Now, what we need is you need a piece of white paper and you need to have a box of crayons or um, pencil. Now Miss Julie's going to use crayons to color in the spider, but I'm gonna draw our spider with a marker. You can use whatever you like. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is draw the spider's eyes. We're going to draw two circles toward the bottom of the page like this. Not too big, because these are his eyes and he's just an itsy bitsy spider. One, two. Now inside of the circles, I'm going to draw another little circle like that and one here as well. Now those circles are going to stay white and we're going to color in the rest of the eye black. And that is going to make the spider's eyes nice and bright. Isn't that cool? See, I kept the white, and I'm gonna do the same thing here. Okay, I'm coloring everything black, but not inside the little circle. And there's his eyes, nice and bright. Now the spider needs a head, so we're going to draw the spider's head, the shape of an oval like that, around an oval shape. There's his head. And of course, it's a happy itsy bitsy spider. It's gonna give him a little tiny smile. Always oh, a cute, cute spider. All right, now we need his body. So I'm gonna draw a U, the letter U, upside down like that to make his body. You ready? I'm gonna take a U and turn it upside down. And there's the itsy bitsy body. <laughs> okay, so our spider needs legs. How many, how many legs does a spider have? 
How many? Eight. That's right. We're going to make four legs on this side and four legs on this side, and that will be eight. Now, to make the legs, you're going to go up here and you're going to go up with a line and down with a line. Then we go right under it. Do the same thing, up and down, up and down, one more, up and down. There are four. We'll make four more here, up and down, up and down, up and down, one more, up and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight legs. Yay! Now he's a spider, so he needs to hang from a web. So we're going to go to his back and we're going to make a wavy line like a web, like the part of a spider web, just like that. Now we're going to color him in. I am going to use black for his body. You can use whatever colors you like, but I'm gonna make the spider's body black. So I color, color, color all around. Now I'm gonna tell you guys something that my mother told me that I never forgot, because I used to not like spiders. She said, oh no, like the spiders, because the spiders eat the bad bugs. I said, the bad bugs? She said, yes. Spiders eat bugs like mosquitoes. Those are those little, little bugs that bite you and make you itchy. So the spiders eat the bad bugs. So spiders are good. Okay, now he's got a nice black body. Now I'm going to use a green crayon for his face. You can use whatever color you like. I just think I'd like to have a green and black spider. You could use red or purple. Now I'm coloring all around, but make sure you don't color in the whites of his eyes there. Because that's what makes them look kind of cool. Coloring all his face. The itsy bitsy spider has a nice green face. <laughs> Watching Miss Julie color all around the place. Okay, he's almost finished. Oh, I wonder what yours looks like. I bet it's adorable. And look, he's finished. And there it is. An itsy bitsy spider. Well, friends, it's time to say goodbye, but I'll be back soon. Let's remember the lesson we learned from our friend, the itsy bitsy spider today. If you are doing something you really want to do and are having trouble, keep up going. That's right, don't give up. From yours truly, Miss Julie. Till next time, ta-ta.